What is going on, Ben Nation? Guys, I got an update for you, and I think you're going to like it. Uh, of course, we've still seen a little bit of a pump now. I know that you're looking for, you know, 3, 4, 5x immediately. We are all looking for that kind of move, but we're seeing positive price action, and we're seeing a reversal of the bottom. Uh, you could argue, by the way, that we did have a double bottom, which we briefly talked about yesterday, and it seems like the reversal is back in. Well, what level can you expect? And I want to say that we're looking at a bit of a, uh, a quick move, I think, coming to the upside in just a little bit. Like, a, And when I say a little bit, I mean just a matter of a few days. I think that we're probably going to see uh, a little push, a little, little push on the price action. Now, some of you are bearish and, and you probably won't survive that. You'll probably try to liquidate your position and and be like, well, oh, I just went, I just, you know what I mean? Or whatever it is that you say. I don't judge what you say. Uh, but, you know, there, there's going to be some sell pressure. There will always be somebody who wants to sell. Um, but generally speaking, uh, I think that we got that uh, double bottom. We got the, the, the move back up to the 5-0. Now it looks like we're probably going to get uh, another move back up, test at 618, maybe the 786 levels. Um, I'll show you what I mean in just a second. Now, if you like this kind of content, make sure that you hit the like button, the subscribe button, the bell to be notified of future content. And uh, let's see what happens. So uh, check this out. We've got uh, uh, money flow looks like it's coming back in. These are these are the important things. Now we're looking on the day chart, by the way. Money flow reversal here. We've got, it looks like a money flow reversal. RSI about to pop over the signal line. Signal line representative, uh, basically, of a, of a moving average. So the RSI uh, starting to look really bullish. Uh, money flow starting to look like it's going to go bullish. Now, if that happens, then you're going to look at something like, you know, maybe something like this. And if something like that were to happen, then you, you kind of uh, take a, a gander, if you will, at what does that look like from here? Uh, and that would look like from here, top right there, putting us at the 786 line or bouncing around at the 618, something like that. Uh, that represents maybe a move to 54 to 5,800. Um, you know, it's not rocket science and it's not exact, but that would then flip the 20. And if that flips the 20 MA, which is this line right here, then you're going to see that start to come back up. Uh, and then you'll see this continue along here and start to smooth its way out. But that would be a bullish reversal. Uh, and, and, you know, you'll probably end up seeing a continuation of this sort of move coming out here. Maybe we even recover uh, back to this level right here. And then that pre presents an opportunity for some tremendous upside. Now, that also represents a resistance area. So we'll see what happens when we get there. But I think in the event that this all works out positively, and I have no reason to think it's not going to work out positively, then this looks like an opportunity for a big time reversal and we're getting closer and closer and closer to a launch of some utility some function that ben's going to see and look the wallet's going to be about mass adoption the dashboard's going to be about mass adoption everything's going to be about mass adoption for ben coin so if that's the case then as we inch our way closer you're going to start to see a lot more people pay attention and if a lot more people are paying attention, then there's a lot more value to the tokens that you are currently holding. So, uh, and that includes, by the way, uh, moving on over here, um, Ben hanging out with um, Hexologist 13, talking about Hex in Idaho, uh, which will include a video that's coming up pretty soon. Uh, you can see uh, Ben here, probably with one of the more handsome people in all of crypto up here as he refers to the lawsuit detail i'm not sure who that guy is but that oh bleeds crypto whoever that is um anyway uh hexologist 31 is uh, uh maxi for pulse chain so there's going to be an interview uh, there's going to be some conversation to be held and maybe just maybe you're going to see ben launching on the pulse chain very very soon to kind of bridge a gap and start that uh, mass adoption phase and to and to maintain itself in DeFi because let's face it this is all about DeFi and Hex has represented DeFi in a in a very fantastic sort of way so you know, perhaps this is the next step and the next evolution of Bencoin as we start to build out this ecosystem but let me know what you think in the comments down below um, also uh, it, it should be noted that. 
Bitcoin is looking like it really wants to run. Now, will it? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Uh, I don't think we correlate directly to that, but I get the sense and the feeling that Bitcoin wants to coil up and it wants to have a big move up. Now, if it does that, then Ethereum, which is really coiled up to have a nice little run, goes along with it. And if that happens, then that's very bullish for Ben overall, because that pairing that we have represents uh, a price movement towards the upside, creating more value on uh, Ben coin directly through the pairing with Ethereum. So I, I just get that feeling that we're getting closer and closer to that move. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. Hit the like button, subscribe button, bell to be notified of future content. And uh, we'll talk to you again very, very soon. It's not financial advice. I'm always right.